bigger couple faces murder charges tonight after authorities say they tried to take the body of a toddler across the border to Mexico. CBS 2's Amy Johnson tells us how the discovery was made. That's certainly sad. Yeah, that's. I can't even believe that. It's sad, really sad. How would somebody would do that? Henry Munez was saddened to hear the news that his former neighbors he identified in these Facebook photos of Johnny Hartley and Mercy Becerra were allegedly caught with the body of a two year old girl in a duffel bag as they crossed the San Diego Mexico border at San Ysidro. But he never had a like attitude or anger or something was how he would flip what you're telling me. Police say Hartley was stopped Tuesday afternoon when an x-ray of his bag revealed the body. Becerra made a run for it but was caught a short time later. San Diego police have confirmed the little girl was not the couple's child, but they won't say how the three were connected before this tragic find. Munya says the couple lived here in apartment three with a number of children. They had like eight. There was a lot of kids. They had like eight, two twins, um, a couple older ones, four or, or, or adults, like a little bit more, like in their teens. Mm -hmm. And yeah, they had several. I'm going to cry over it because that's terrible. <laughs> These neighbors who lived near the couple's old Whittier apartment didn't know the couple who moved out three years ago, but were shocked by the news. It, it's heartbreaking. An autopsy is being done today to determine exactly how the little girl died. In Whittier, Amy Johnson, CBS 2 News.